This workflow will cover Petrel Direct plugin that allows OpenDetect Pro user to seamlessly exchange data with Petrel. The data exchange exercise can be replicated only if Petrel Direct plugin is installed and OpenDetect Pro and Petrel licenses are available. The first step is to verify that Petrel Direct plugin is installed in OpenDetect and Petrel, then establish the connection between Petrel and OpenDetect. Set up quickly an OpenDetect survey from an existing Petrel project and start loading the data from Petrel to OpenDetect. The first thing to do is to verify that Petrel Direct is installed and license available. This is done through Utilities, Installation, Plugin, under OpenDetect Pro. We can see Petrel Direct. It's installed and we just check that the license is available. If Petrel Direct is not installed, you can refer to the OpenDetect administrator's manual to install it. This is step-by-step -step guide on how to install it and configure it. Once the installation has been done, just restart OpenDetect and go again to the OpenDetect plugin manager and observe that Petrel Direct is listed and license is active. You can close the license manager. Now we do the same thing in Petrel's side to verify that OpenDetect DGB plugin is installed. We go to File and Option Plugin Manager and we verify that data access to OpenDetect DGB plugin is installed and the license is available. Ticked green. If the plugin is not installed, refer to the OpenDetect administrator's manual to install it. This is again step-by-step -step guide on how to install and configure data access to OpenDetect DGB plugin in Petrel. Once the installation has been done, restart Petrel and go back to the plugin manager and verify that the plugin is installed and license is available. Then go to Seismic Interpretation tab and observe that OpenDetect toolbar is there now. Last tab in the toolbar, as you can see here. Select Petrel Project of Interest. Then we go back to OpenDetect project to establish the connection between Petrel and OpenDetect. At the start, the Petrel connection is disabled in the lower right corner of the main OpenDetect window. Select Enable Petrel connection from the drop-down menu. The Petrel Direct status icon become active, green, then select Initialize the Petrel connection if it's not already the case. The icon turns orange, indicating that the connection has been established between Petrel and OpenDetect. If you click on the Petrel connection icon where it shows the TCP port number, this port number must be the same as the port number specified in the Petrel side. The default number should work in most cases. Now we will show how we can quickly set up an OpenDetect survey from an existing Petrel project using Petrel Direct. So we go to Survey, Select Setup, Create a new survey. Select Use Betrayal Direct. Give a new survey name. Survey from Petrel, for example. We select Z domain time. Next. Then we select the seismic data set from the Petrel project to set up the Open Detect survey. And then we OK. You can see the survey information filled in automatically from the selected Petrel project setup. 
then we OK to set up the survey. You select Yes. This option allows you to import all data in one go from Petrel to OpenDetect. All objects can be selected or they can be filtered by data type, for example, wells, horizons, or you can filter by name. In this case, we are going to select all objects and OK. For a large amount of data, you can use the batch mode. Once the loading finished, you can cancel the window, select the project, then QC all the loaded data through the manager, the 3D seismic surfaces, wells, etc. Now we are going to see another way of importing individual data type from Petrel to OpenDetect using Petrel Direct. In the previous exercise of creating OpenDetect survey using Petrel setup, we have selected yes to proceed with bulk import from Petrel to OpenDetect. In this case, we are going to select no to proceed with individual data imports from Petrel to OpenDetect. The first data type we are going to import from Petrel to OpenDetect is 3D Seismic. So we go to Survey, Import, Seismic, Petrel Direct, and we select Cube. Then we select the Seismic Cube from the Import Petrel Seismic Cube window. In this example, we select the original Seismic Petrel. There is possibility for subselection of this cube through volume subselection. We can create either a link to Petrel or copy. Make note that the link to Petrel option requires Petrel license to be available to use the seismic in OpenDetect, where OpenDetect copy will allow you to use the data you copied without Petrel license. We can keep the original name for the output cube at the destination by ticking this option, and there is the possibility to use a batch mode for a large amount of data, then run. Specify if you want to import more objects, we just say no. The next object type we will import is fault. Go to survey, import, faults, Petrel direct, then we select the faults of interest. We have the option for a link or a copy. We'll keep the default and use the original name in the destination, then run. Do you want to import more objects? We say no. The next object type will be Horizon. Survey, Import, Horizon, Petrel Direct, 3D Horizon. We select the Horizon from the Import Petrel Horizon window. The attributes associated with the particular Horizon, in this case, there is none. We use a copy and the original name as output, then run. Now for importing more Horizon. Next, data type to load wells. So survey, import, wells, Petrel Direct. We can select one well or all the wells from the import Petrel well window. In this case, we will select all the wells and there is an option to select only common logs and common markers to all these wells. Then we select the logs and the markers, create a copy and OK. 
Next data type to import is wavelets. So we go to survey, import, wavelets, the trail directs, select the wavelet we want to import, copy and use the original name, then run. Last data type example we are going to import from Petrel is Polygon. So we go to Survey, Import, Point Set Polygon, Petrel Direct Polygon. We select the polygon, use a copy and same name as the original name, then run. Do you want to import more object? No. All imported data can be QC'd using the data managers and uh, all the visualization tools. And finally, compare the imported data in OpenDetect with the original data in Petrel. This concludes this workflow where we show how to set up OpenDetect survey from Petrel project setup and import data from Petrel to OpenDetect as a bulk data or as individual data.